The pandemic happened, but the thought of Christmas and the holiday season has not changed. That wanting to give back is absolutely, it's still embedded in all of us. I know it's embedded in Tom and Holly's family. The shift, you know, because of the pandemic had made people think around the box and it caused us as Marines to, you know, adapt and overcome. I remember when I was nine years old receiving toys from the Marine Corps. They gave me the Army Green Men, that's all I really wanted. It's made a huge impact in my life. I want to be a protector, defender of the city, and then see children, when they see them get the toys and they see the Marines give it to them, that gives them hope, inspiration, and promote innovation. So it does a lot for the community. So this year has been painful, but I'm just happy to still be alive. I was living from hotel to hotel. My 11-year-old kept telling me, like, I wish people would, you know, stop saying that they're going to help, and they're not. And they finally called me. We're thankful for the Toys for Tots Foundation, and things has been really hard this year, so every little bit counts. It's all about the children in the community and their future, and it's one of the things that I've been very passionate about. For 14 years, Tom and Holly have been partnered with Toys for Tots Giving Events. Over that 14 year span, there's been over 120,000 toys distributed. This year alone, there's been over 10,000 toys. Providing hope for the future, that to me is beyond anything I could do specifically. That feeling of excitement, to have hope, that to me is more exciting than anything. Tom and Holly Gores, I can't think of enough and the community thanks them as well. They all know that the Gores family take care of them for Christmas season. I really like, really appreciate the Gores family. I appreciate them to the max.